hello guys how are you all welcome back to another video guys today we are going to discuss how we can read excel through javascript as you can see on the screen we have something called packet.json we have an excel file called text excel.xlsx so let me open that excel and let, let us see the content what content we have we have a table called fruits table in that we have a serial name serial number and name so first is apple second is banana third is orange let me close this so now we have to read that through a javascript file so for that let me create one javascript uh, file guys new file so let me put uh, read excel.js javascript file so in the read.xl.js file so to do this guys we need a node package so what node package will be suitable to read excel we have something called sl access package so let me install that so npm install sl sx so this is the package where we can install it here so that uh, it can read the excel and it can give all the object properties so we have a node module so we can now read excel so let me create one var variable in that i can write slx is equal to so now we are now declaring as require in the sense it the this slx object variable will have all the properties of this node module slx so that uh, we can get all the required properties of uh, excel now let us declare a data path so let me declare where data path of excel so directly we have test excel dot excel sex now let me read the file so let me write a workbook so slxx dot so as you can see here we have all the properties of slx so let me read the file now so we need files so as soon as you open it it will show you the properties so now as soon as you open this we can see the file name as string and options as optional parameter we'll see what are optional parameter later so for now let me declare the date path excel so let me write var sheet name equal to so wb will have all the properties of the sheet now need sheet names when i showed you the excel in the beginning i had a sheet first shield which has a table of fruits so let me take sheet names of zero by default it will like the first sheet sheet value equal to wb dot sheet name sorry wb dot you know to read the sheet value we have to give sheets of sheet name so it is sheets of sheet name So let me print the sheet value. We can now get the sheet values. So let me now run a node. Let me now run a JavaScript file. So node read excel.js. So now you can see here 
it has printed according to the format it is showing the range is from a1 to b4 let me open the excel file the range is from a1 to b4 yes so what a1 has a serial number b1 has a name so it is uh, it is printing according to it is not printing in a conventional way right it is giving slash t giving table with value and then in b3 we have these banana value etc so how to get this in a normal range variable in order to do that we have to take a temporary variable and we have to read the expected value the sheet value and convert it to json file so when we convert to json file it will then read each and every value so in order to convert the json excel file let us write let excel data equal to util dot sheet to json of the sheet value so sorry let me declare a var here now let me cons uh, let me just print this value excel data mm. now let me execute it read excel dot js sorry read excel dot js file so you can see here we have got the response in the form of a json where the column serial number is one the name value is uh, apple when have when we have a column value as two serial number we have a name banana the fruit banana when have when we have a column name value three we have um fruit value as one so this is a simple example of how we can read an excel by uh, javascript so let me recap you what we did we are now reading here an excel file with a node package the package is xlsx for that we have to install node npm install slxs then we then the node package is installed here so node package slxs as you can see here so now once it is installed so once it is installed we have a text uh, xlsx excel file I, I suppose it is open here so now we have a simple data of serial number and name as precisely as a fruit name so let me convert this convert this entire thing into a table let me convert this into a table so now so serial number and a uh, name a name of the fruits apple banana and orange i have just given the serial number the motive behind this video is to just read an excel by using uh, javascript now we now we have you we are using a simple read excel.js file where we have excel sx package which um, which is taking from an excel sx node require is the property which enables this variable to have all the properties of excel sx now we are creating one more variable called data path excel where we are giving the excel path this we can in future programs or maybe when you are doing a different project this can be dynamic based on which a type of excel we want to use and here we are writing we are just giving a variable wb in order to read the file we when we have the excel sx variable read file is one of the properties in this variable here we are reading the file and the file in we are giving in the function data file path excel path 
and we have an optional parameter but optional parameter for the time being we are not giving it now we are giving the sheet name a sheet name as we have seen in the excel we have the first sheet so i have given the sheets sheet names of zero and the sheet value we can get from this particular sheet name so i have so executed this program and i have got i have printed this value so let me just see the value here so the value will come in a different abrupt manner so it will show the range first of all which is a1 to b4 and it will give the sheet name column names etc which is not properly readable so and so on so uh, see the margins and all it is giving so in order to read this file properly so we are converting the what sheet value whatever we have got to sheet x uh, sheet to json file so when we convert it to json file it will come in a readable format so let me just print this when we print it so we have got a day we have got an array of json where we are typing the two column values serial number and name and the column values these are column names and these are the column values that's it for the video guys if you like this video please click on like if you are a new viewer please click on subscribe till then guys take care have a great day bye bye